Hello, hello everyone. How is it going? Welcome to the stream. Oh my goodness, I am quite loud today. Oh, let me turn it down a little bit. There we go. Now, welcome to Warhammer Inquisitor Martyr. This is one I tried to play before. Unfortunately, uh, it didn't work out so well, it wouldn't upload properly. So we'll try this again. We're gonna go ahead and create a new character. I can't do tech adept yet because I haven't brought prophecy yet, but they're also really cool and I would like to do one at some point. Maybe after I get prophecy. I don't have any money right now. But yeah, you can adept as uh, Secutor, which is the melee type. Adeptus Dominus, which is the uh, mobile range dealer, and the Adeptus Scatarus, which is the Scatari one. Scatari are like the vanguard, but each class has three archetypes, one including melee, one kind of a mixture, and one ranged. The uh, Crusader has the Assault Crusader, which is more about storm shields and plowing through and plowing through uh, bad guys with reckless jetpack. Uh, the Tactical Crusader is more about dual wielding and uh, um, warping around the map. I mean, you can blend any of these together, so. Then you have the assault, or the heavy gunner, which is more about, well, big fucking weapons. Yeah. Uh, then you have assassin with the sniper rifle, the infiltrator, which is the double blades, and then you have basically the in-your-face uh, in your face version. And then my personal favorite, the Psyker. Uh, basically, what type of perils of the warp do you want to deal with? Do you want to deal with a big stick, a little stick and a sword, or a little stick and a pistol? Basically, they're, uh, each one does or each one of the armors does different things, each one of the weapons does different things, uh, but if I remember correctly, so having the big four staff gives you more access to more uh, force powers. Having the smaller stick gives you less access, but then you can have a second weapon. And as much as I don't like the Imperium armor because I think is yeah all it does is it slows time in a small area but we'll go with this one so we'll call channel name <sighs> part of me wants to skip the tutorial but the tutorial is actually not bad, so we'll actually play the tutorial. Just because. It is the 41st millennium. There is. The Imperium of Man besieged from all sides by Xenos races and it's slow rotting away from the inside by chaos. Inquisitors are autonomous, powerful agents who wage war against the great secrets of man. Uh. I cannot talk today. They are the judges and the executioners. So, for those of you who... Inquisitor's Log. Classified report for later transmission. I am closing on the source of the inquisitorial distress signal I was assigned to investigate. It has an ancient encryption used by the Holy Orders. It's authentic, but extremely old. 
The intensity of the Caligari warp searches is beyond anything I've experienced. There were many delays during the journey. But the coordinates I received from the Caligari Conclave finally led me to this desolate system. The signal is coming from a battered fortress monastery. It got through the warp surges with considerable loss of data, and my astropath has been unable to decipher it. I will personally investigate the source of this mysterious signal. Inquisitor, this is your captain speaking. I'm still trying to hail the monastery, but I get no response. The hull looks intact, though. I think it was simply abandoned a very long time ago. Then what do you expect to find over there? Something that once belonged to the Inquisition. And lots of empty halls. Sounds exciting. I've instructed your pilots to land on the hangar deck. Stand by and wait for my signal. Inquisitor, the automatic defense system has been activated. The turrets are attacking you. Do you... Do -do -do -do. For those of you who don't know, Inquisitors are essentially the agents of the Empire who are above the law. They are the law. And if they say that you need to be purged, well, by God, you will be purged. Captain, do you copy? Captain Van Winter, can you hear me? Strange. Box communication is jammed. And I can't use my teleporter device. Something must be disturbing my signal. I will record everything in my audio log in case I don't return. Inquisitorial log. Oh no. New entry. While attempting to I dock in the hangar of an I think something's wrong here. Known fortress monastery. My transport yeah, took heavy fire. That's too the janky. What's going on? The automatic weapon systems were activated, What's going but I don't on? yet know why. The transport. Let me turn it down low. Let's it's been see destroyed. If that helps. Along with my equipment. My pilot is dead. Oh, it's not break. helping at all. It's very fidgety. Try very low. For him later. No. Nothing's working. That's weird. Oh well. I'll just set it up high and deal with the issue. I guess. Let's deal with it. I don't like it, but I don't know what's going on. It's jumping every so often, and it shouldn't be doing that. I don't know if it's just that I went overboard on the graphics, or what? What the hell? Uh, sort of helped. Still weird. Interesting. Mindless servitors were created for menial tasks, but having a flash drone just for operating the door seems excessive. Open the door. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. 
just go in and walk over this way. Yeah, uh, activate the cogitator. An ancient cogitator. Let's see if the tech prayer still hold. It might have information about this place. Hello, hello. In possession of the Holy Orbs of the Inquisition. Warning, verify current status. Inadequate data collected. Last maintenance logged. Warning, Geller Shields compromised. Current state of impairment 43 uh, 47.34% estimated. Prayers of maintenance required in the following zones. Interesting. No. Oh, just as I suspected. It's a pile of rust. Well, at least I found some interesting diagnostics. I should check all the cogitators on the ship for other details. <laughs> New log entry. <laughs> Bodies everywhere. The putrid hey, stench of death. Horrible wounds still ooze. How's blood. it going? What unholy beast stalks these halls, I wonder. I actually, I enjoy this game, but for some reason it's just lacking for me. I don't know why. I like this game, though. It's a fun. Weapon. Well, the Emperor does protect his loyal subjects. A manifestation of chaos. Will it cleanse your taint from here? Oh, shit. Okay. I feel the contagion of chaos seeping into the walls. I taste the despair in the air. This illness must be purged before it's too late. Any more paint? New log entry. I've found a room tainted by the filth of chaos. There is also a tech priest maintenance shrine with a functioning cogitator. <sighs> Defense system anomalies. Ranking security officer, brother Marcus Drag. Instant log. The martyr opened fire on an approaching rogue trader vessel, causing considerable damage and loss of life to target ship. Teleportation signals are regularly jammed, blocking entry and exit from the monastery. Confession of related personnel during the penitence hearing. Searching for pre to recording database. Records not found. Conclusion. After... Thorough investigation and questioning, I can safely claim that no personnel were involved in the incident. The, tur the defense turrets opened fire without any human involvement, and the signal blocking any teleportation attempts is generated automatically. How will it cause? System malfunction. Process initiated. Logged at a priority level request to the maintenance facility awaiting confirmation. Had emergency cogitators installed on the hangar decks and main cogitator in the control room, where security personnel can manually override both turret systems and teleportation signals in case of any further incidents. Attachment Medic uh, Medicare records of personnel voluntary p participating in confessions. Data corrupted. I found new information. There's an emergency cogitator nearby where I could turn off the jamming signals. Open the door. It is in the walls now. Everywhere. Taint. In the... machines. Oh, by the Emperor. What foul abomination is this? I don't know, but it's a bit of heresy. I smell corruption. Very exciting. Mind the door, please. Foul 
all heretics. Let my powers cleanse you from your sins. Finally, that's the cogitator that will disable the jammer. Uh, lovely. Deactivating. I couldn't turn off the teleportation jammer, Ooh. but the Vox should be fine now. Captain Van Winter, <laughs> can you hear me? Inquisitor, finally. I thought we'd lost you. It would have been quite convenient for you, I suppose. Trust me, I'm on your side. I'm not saying I don't want my ship back, but who would clear my name if you died in battle? Your loyalty is quite admirable, Captain. Psychic focus, I got a new spell and a passive skill point. So, for the most part, maybe we can just go character. Yeah. 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 But yeah, these are all skills you can do. Yeah, there's a whole, like, benefit to being super high warp heat. There's also a huge downside if you do. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'll just leave it how it is for now. And, hmm, do I want, interesting, so the question is, do I want to go ahead and increase my max warp heat and resource class, or do I want to increase my damage, uh, or I can increase my resilience, but, We'll go ahead and just keep increasing this. Actually, you know what? I'm done. So I can get the uh, suppression damage. Oh. And then we'll go ahead and put a bunch in there. Yeah, we'll go ahead and do it all in there. Oh, good, 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 good. Right. We'll go ahead and increase the radius of area effect stuff. And oh boy. Did get a psychic like, focus, right? Something right. Thought we didn't. Oh well. Uh. Yep. But yeah. We can't do much until later anyways. We're still on the martyr, after all. Alright. 
time to go to the next mission. Having some fun, kicking some butt, killing some demons. Our Argos have picked up a Vox signal not far from your location. It is transmitting on an Imperial channel. It could be important. I'm on my way there. Oh my goodness. Why is it doing that? Just random frame rate drops for no reason. Uh, okay. There we go. I, the Emperor. By the Emperor. What have you found down there, Inquisitor? A vile display of cruelty and madness. A sacrifice to the dark gods and their acolytes prowling these decks. In other words, there's something on that ship that requires human sacrifice. Wonderful. Oh. I don't think I need to dodge when I can just shoot all of you in a single shot. Hey look, a cogitator. I don't really care. It's just more backstory. A crude tool of mindless destruction. I'm sure it'll be useful on this ship. Oh yeah. Always is. A proper welcome committee at last. That grenade could be useful now. Oh. Kill the heretic! Uh, he's not so worthy, I guess you And then you can actually hop on this. Boop. <laughs> and yes, the actual like walls and everything blow up. It's one of the reasons why I like this game so much. It's because everything like actually can be manipulated in some aspect. Oh, what's over here? Oh, the cogitator. A bunch of dead bodies. Most of the cogitator stuff is just backstory or useless information. Still nice to grab down. I found down. a corpse of an Imperial soldier. I'll take his data slate. It could contain a recording that could shed some light on what happened here. Oh. Hey, look, it's a helper. <laughs> it's kind of cool, though. You can fight worse things than Hellbirds in this game, let me tell you. I think at one point you even played it straight up Demon Prince. I found the body of a fallen Adeptus Astartes. Yay, Space Marine. What? Did you just say that there was a dead Space Marine down there? He must have been a member of that unlucky Imperial reconnaissance team I found. Oops. Allow me to clarify that. You only found pieces of them. 
So it'll be just you against something that tore apart one of the mightiest champions of the Imperium. Don't jump to any conclusions just yet, Captain. It could easily be more than one creature. That's supposed to make it sound so much better. I guarantee you she is probably even more worried. Because if I die, then she's dead. Did she let an, an agent of the Imperium of man die? Oh, oh no. What, what are you... What are those things? But yeah, for those of you who are wondering why I'm not doing VR chat today, it's mostly because I was just... Did you think a horde can withstand my powers? I'm just mostly tired and I don't want to play games today. I mean, obviously I want to play a game, I just don't want to play games with people. I'm tired, I don't want to mess with people today. So, I hopped on here. I have done a game where I go around killing people instead. Team Sigma, this is Chaos Thorn speaking. Team Sigma, come in. I'm afraid Team Sigma won't be responding anytime soon. What? Who are you, and what are you doing there? Taking a stroll on the decks by the Maybe. Emperor? Mind your manners. I'm an Inquisitor, and I don't tolerate... An Inquisitor? About bloody time. I thought your lot had followed Lord Klosterheim into the Dark Zone. Listen, we're under heavy attack in the control room, so I'd appreciate it if you could join us while we deliver the Emperor's will until our most triumphant death, Thorn out. Wow. New log entry. I established connection with someone from an Imperial expedition on the ship. But he is clearly confusing me with someone else. Yeah, well, you kind of let him. He didn't really do anything to change his mind. Do do do. I like playing games that uh, involve 40k because 40k is like one of my favorite genres there's a lot of lore it's dark nobody gives a shit <laughs> if you're Sorry about that. My frames aren't really bad, apparently. Right, we got a new neural port, some frag grenades, and a better purity cell. That's almost exactly the same, so no point. Forbidden cult mission. Do 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 Alright, let's go. Run through the halls. It's thorn again. Another wave of filth is on its way to face me in a glorious carnage. I want your help as soon as possible. 
Careful, Thorn. That was dangerously close to insolence. And you are definitely confusing me with someone else. You are an Inquisitor, which is enough for me right now. The whole deck is swarming with the local mongrel tribes, and they've sent their champions to rally the troops. I need you to eliminate these creatures. It will slow down the tribes. It'll still be fun to kill things. So you're heading to the control room to disable the jammer? That's the plan, yes. And who is this Caius Thorn exactly? Quite a character. Otherwise, I have no idea. He seems to think that I'm a member of his mysterious expedition. If there is an expedition, they might be trapped in that monastery just like you. Why do you think so? I made a scan. That giant wreckage looks completely dead from here. No sign of any other voidcraft in the vicinity. Interesting. They said they entered the dark zone though, so... of the original inhabitants. I guess I'll know more soon. So, the thing about Warping is sometimes it can be good, sometimes it can be bad. Just decides to be good and decides to be bad. Yep. It, I mean, it can be good. It can be very useful. Building up your warp heat sometimes drops bonus effects that you would never think of. Sometimes it'll just straight up heal you. Sometimes it'll just drop a demon prince on your ass. <laughs> so you always have to be careful. Which is really nasty. Are you faring, Inquisitor? Oh. Considering that I'm alone, I'd say I'm making adequate progress. Alone? Where's the rest of your detachment? Under some smoldering wreckage. Well, that's unlucky. But that's all the more demons for us to kill. Let us rejoice in the furious challenge. Thorn out. I love Thorn. He is definitely. One of those that's all balls, no brains. But you can't blame him for that. Nor would I. Two birds with one stone. Or one staff in this case. You need to go away. Alright. There we go. The 
filth of chaos has retreated from my door. Regrouping, I'd say. I take it you killed the tribal champions. Yes, I purged the place. How ambitious. I like that. But believe me, there is still much work to be done. You'll find a desecrated shrine next door that leads to the control room. Go there. Do do do. Oh, we got big guy over there. Sure, why not? Ah, warp storm. Oh yeah, then in here sometimes. Astral blessing. Think it I've reached the end of this increases subject. all of your stats by 50 percent there is the exit some of my men will meet you or on the other like side that. but plenty of them have been captured I'll need your help to set them free do <laughs> Yep, I got. I can now get plasma pistols and warp rods. Alright, oh, I got a passive upgrade. mission <clears throat> this is just the calm before the storm take advantage of the respite before the wretches return at least I can send you some reinforcements the hostiles are keeping some of my scouts caged up in the desecrated sanctum Free the guardsmen and bring them to the control room. Ah, useless guardsmen. How useless you are. But you shall be shields for my greatness. That was most remarkable. Uh, new log entry. This sanctum gives me the shivers. The iconography is clearly imperial in origin, and... It points to an ancient sect. Uh, but the details of these statues look strange to me. Looks like space reigns. Rather than the Emperor. Nothing really in here. Ready to fight. By the way, the guardsmen don't run away. They'll just keep shooting until they die. Even when they're about to die. They don't run away. Which is more can be said than when the commissars. Because you do get a Kamazar and he runs away every opportunity he gets. It's pretty fucking hilarious. And he's got a fucking sword. Yes, use your puny little flashlights to take out the enemy. Don't have much time in 
Inquisitor. Hurry up and take as many guardsmen with you as you can. Charge! I said charge! Ready to fight! I'm about to do some guardsmen. Oh, I'm actually surprised they baited the they baited the enemy. They usually don't do that. All right. And yes, getting them on your or freeing the prisoners get you more guardsmen. The more guardsmen you have. Well, the easier some things are. But, they only stick around until the end of the mission. Do you know what my command is? Shoot things. Take bullets for me. Cards? I don't know. It's right there. Doesn't happen very often, but I have lost all of my guardsmen before. Because, uh, I was stupid. The humans are banging their war drums, calling up the filth of chaos from the caverns of the ship. If you want to know what a real battle looks like, I suggest you join me as soon as you can. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm coming. At your command. Do, do, do. Caligari credits. <sighs> You'll use those for upgrading things later, but for now we will just play around. I do like the fact that they made it so that way you can change your weapons out on the fly. Inquisitor, our Argus are starting to pick up huge waves of hostiles approaching your position. Can you hold them off on your own? You are addressing a servant of the Imperium who must be watchful all the time, lest corruption consumes his soul. I'm quite <laughs> resilient. So what is your plan? Yes, yes, the power we draw upon takes so many shapes and forms. Hmm, a touch of righteous violence, maybe. Or perhaps something more refined. I think I'll improvise. I'll have the transport ship ready, just in case. Oh, and yes, you can make your... Crusader look like that with the teleportation armor and the shield and sword. It's quite exhilarating.
Not my favorite armor, but it is better than what I got. I can't change my spells yet, so... Welcome to the Martyr, Inquisitor. Not exactly the army I had imagined, but reinforcements at last. So you do realize now that I don't belong to your expedition? I do, and I regret the confusion. We were not <laughs> expecting any guests on this Emperor Forsaken Wreck. And first I thought that you must belong to Klosterheim's retinue. That fool brought a whole army of busybodies and interrogators with him. You must tell me everything about this man, his expedition, and the martyr. But first, I'll disable the teleport jammer. The cogitator that overrides the jammer is two hallways away, and the whole control deck is swarming with feral tribes. Why do you think I'm stuck in this hole? They're keeping us pinned down in here. Time to turn the tide together, Sergeant. Inquisitor, we have a problem. is not a good time. Up, wasn't it? But Inquisitor, I'm sure they will drink. There, what? We interrogated some of these tribesmen. They are all descendants of the original crew. Anyway, during centuries of drifting through the void, one of their generations forgot about our holy emperor and found new things to worship. And what would this god be? Madness incarnated, they call it. It could be anything, if you ask me. Oh, but oh. nothing good. Ready Don't need a phone call. Inquisitor, listen to me. The monastery is. I'm in the middle of something. Later. Let's wait till we start seeing space marines. Yes.
Let's take a look at this cogitator. Well, these records are disturbing. This martyr has a mind of its own. Those ships alive. thundering blast of weapons i wish my brothers were here to hear this canticle of death talking about brothers which chapter do you belong to i'm not familiar with this iconography i am sergeant chaos storm of the Stormwatcher space marines explain i don't know that chapter i would be truly disappointed if you did our existence <laughs> is secret our numbers are few and our burden is terrible we are the watchers in the shadows, but rest assured, we are the sanctioned blades of the Calgary Conclave. I believe that we they're want, exactly. dying gloriously uh, during a branch of the Inquisitorial missions. Raven Claw? Could we talk no. about uh, this? Yeah. Inquisitor, Raven the monastery shows signs up. Not now. Truly doing the Emperor's work, Inquisitor. Keep it up. We've crushed their main forces. Let's sure. move out and disable that jammer. Before their... what? Their god arrives? Trust me. <laughs> it is already close. I wonder what it looks like. After we've disabled the jammer, we must find Lord Klosterheim. Oh, yes. That two-faced <laughs> hypocrite. I have already lost a battle brother because of him, and then he left me down here to die. But now, move! At your command! <laughs> Oh no, it's a helper. Oh, traitorous scum! Mockery to your honor! Perish, you filth! down there are you all right i'm great i've just killed a hellbrute a twisted mockery of a space marine praise the emperor i also have an imperial space marine with grievous wounds and i want to bring him aboard our ship inquisitor listen to me the monastery has turned on the warp drives and it's ready to leave the star system disable the jammer now <laughs> at your command for those of you who don't know uh going through the warp without shields is a death sentence. 
Anybody who's I'll living on there the gets twisted uh, and turned into mince meat. Mince meat. Inquisitor, you must teleport back before the ship leaves. We don't know where it's headed, and worse, the jealous shields are probably compromised. Warp travel would kill you. Hurry up, you don't want to get stranded over there. Loop. And then the martyr powers up and takes off. <sighs> Interesting. No. Don't know what's going on with the graphics, though. It's kind of irritating me. So I'll probably end it after this. And then switch Inquisitor, to a different game. My astropath has sent your audio log to the Caligari Conclave, as you requested. Let me guess. Another local warp search manifestation swallowed the message whole. No, actually. We have received an official follow-up on your report. Well, that must be a mistake. It's the Imperial bureaucracy. I wasn't expecting to hear from them for a few standard years. I have no idea what we found out there, but it must be really important. <laughs> See for yourself. Inquisitor, we are raising your clearance, Rami. You are henceforth authorized to listen to confidential information without facing immediate excommunication. Your discovery has greatly intrigued the conclave you have found a ghost of the past inquisitor the martyr had strong ties to the inquisition and as such it is very important to us we all thought that the fortress monastery had been destroyed with the exception of lord inquisitor Kloster Heidman. he dedicated his life to finding the martyr only to disappear without a trace and now you have proof of both the existence of the Martyr and the whereabouts of Lord Klosterheim. We want answers. Continue this investigation. Evaluate the data. Gather new clues and find the Martyr. Hopefully with Lord Klosterheim on board so he can explain his disappearance. We must remind him that this investigation requires absolute secrecy. And it will be your task. And your task alone so the comment this is very important to note because the inquisition or the imperial the imperial bureaucracy sometimes sometimes takes hundreds of years to go our task is to find a ghost ship in the vast expanses of the Imperium. How hard could it be? The Space Marine I rescued was part of the expedition that found the Martyr somehow. If I can interrogate him, I'm sure he can help us. That man is in stasis at the moment. He was torn into pieces. Correct me if I'm wrong, but a warrior of the Adeptus Astartes is not a simple mortal we can treat. Indeed. We need a tech priest with unique skills and knowledge of the genetic material of the Adeptus Astartes. We need a Magos biologist specialist, which could be difficult. Indeed. I come from a long line of rogue traders, Inquisitor. I know the secrets of this sector, and I can tell you where to find the tech priest you need. The Merciful Agony is a hospital fortress in the Chernobog system. 
It's also a secret research station of the Adeptus Mechanicus. You'll find a Magus Biologus there. Hey, command bridge. Got a new spell. Got a passive skill trait. Yep. 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 Alright. So these are all things that you can get as essentially pets. But I was here since whatever. Seriously, I was here since the founding. Maybe it's it, I have these. Whatever. Thomas over skull, yes. Praise the Emperor. Heresy. Yeah, I can't deal with the janky. Every time, every now and then it just clicks. So, I'm gonna switch to a different game. I'll be right back. Alright guys, don't go anywhere. I'll be right back.
All right, there we go. We're gonna play some Space Marine instead. That's what we'll play. Go ahead and turn back on the volume. Uh, I believe that the, the the games aren't the online part isn't going running anymore, but you can still play the campaign. The campaign is fun. Go normal. Only war! Because it's 40k. Only war. Worlds are where they make things world class type. The warlord class type. Strategic value absolute. Xenos invasion in progress. Recommendation course of action. Exterminatus. Negative. Strategic value absolute. Deploy capital weaponry. Negative. Estimated reduction in manufactured output. Liberation fleet? Affirmative. Oof. Delay. Unacceptable. Adeptus Astartes Ultra. Response. Deploying your Ultramarines. Fuck yeah. Send those blue smurfs. Oh. Battle cruiser. If you guys have never played this game, this game is a real treat, let me tell you. It's only five to six hours long, story-wise. But it's just five to six hours of the most fun, entertaining, testosterone, rage-inducing greatness that is Space Marines. And yes, almost all of the objectives in the game are like three or four words long. Captain Titus, the Orcs have massacred the Forge World's forces, and they have taken the planetary defense weapons. Clever of the damned Orcs. Keeps us off their backs while they loot the Titan war machines. Brace for evasive maneuvers. Pilot, report. Starboard engine is dead, Sergeant. We are losing altitude. Get the ship to safety. We'll find another way down. Aye, Captain. Gotta grab a jetpack. So why the fuck not? This is your plan. We need to get to the surface to take out the gun battle. What do you want to go home already, Sergeant? Sorry, my bad. Not before having a word or two with the Orcs. Is that wise, Captain? The Codex Astartes does not support this action. Try to keep up. I love how it's just a little bit loose with the Codex. Favorite green skin. Oh yeah, look at them. Makes me wonder how the fuck they're destroying those ships, though. Yeah, must 
bring about violent death. The mysteries that you never solve, but that's just because orc weaponry just works. I'm pretty sure most of their ships are held together with nails and paper clips. And maybe some duct tape. Titus, come in. Damned orc shot me off course. I've had no word from Leandros, but I'm picking up box chatter from Imperial Guard forces on the ground. I scarcely thought anyone would be left alive, much less still fighting. 
Heading towards the front lines now. I will meet you there. I would say this game reminds me of Gears of War, but this I think is a lot more edgier than Gears of War in a lot of aspects. So slow. In orderly fashion. Public disturbances will not be tolerated. Look, the space marines! Do I need to turn down the well, I can't do it from here apparently. Whatever. Bolters. Good gun. This white voice. I'm gonna kill it first. My oh yeah. Destroy them! I suck at you, apparently. They got no way out of there. Beat you all to death? Huh? But you were green skins. We're like coward skins. This isn't an assault rifle, boys. This is a bolter. If you want to know basically what these things are, the bolters are like are you wounded? Sub uh, machine guns that fire soda cans that are rocket propelled and explode as soon as they enter. If that isn't your days as a novice are behind you. A fucking cannon gun. Or a cannon so machine gun. I don't know what it is. I looked at its rules for guidance. We all do. But there are also benefits to thinking for yourself. There it is. And that's why he's a commander and not a private. Enemy! Sighted! <laughs> Good ammo. No, 
was this morning. Oh well. Sedona's picked up local Imperial Guard do, communications. Do, do, do. They survived under the shadow of that gun. I wonder who's watching me I now. I don't know how. Keep firing! Keep firing! How about I kill everything on the street? Let's take walk up to you covered in fucking blood. Rise, guardsmen. You saved yourselves. We thought you did. We would be, my lord, if not for the lieutenant. Where will we find this lieutenant? At the front lines. Follow the trench network to the lieutenant's command bunker. Carry on, guardsmen. We rendezvous with Sedonus, then we find this lieutenant. We need updated intel on the gun battery. And the just blood just disappears all of a sudden. Okay. Through here, my lords. Head out the upper level and continue through the plaza. The bunker is beyond there. Remarkable. A few hundred against a million orcs. And they fight on. One near death. No. Get off! My legs. I can't feel my legs. Space Marine would bring hope to the Imperium of Man. I'm just realizing. Why is there no subtitles? What are. I also want to know why it keeps slowing down like this. Captain, I'm in position at a broken monument near the guard lines. I am coming. Quotas must be met. Despite alien incursion, delinquency is an affront to the chief of Space Marines again! Shoot me again! Oh, Spitz. One of the best Space Marines I know. I see you found something to keep you busy. Worry not, Captain. I've saved some orcs for you. The orcs have got that gun well defended, no mistake. A typical orc behavior would be to dismantle or destroy the gun. And certainly not use it to keep our forces at bay. There's a strategy behind it. Their leader is no fool. This day is getting interesting. And smart orcs. I may have are encountered them during our very uncomfortable. That was the orc ship I saw crash near here, I take it. Did he survive? If the horde hasn't oh. turned on itself, it's still under his control. 
Chainsword. Fuck yes. Kill every last one of us! Oh, this is a chainsword. Zooming is not zooming in this one. It's attacking. Kill their own allies. Look out, drop ship. Guys, too many of them. They never stop. That is too many. Ship incoming!
Oh, it's a knob. Ultramarines, open this door. Space Marines. <laughs> this game goes real quick, let me tell you. Greenskins are headed here from the south. If I do, one of these days I'm gonna go and collect all the different collectibles. Reinforce their position. Hold the line. Because I can. There's not really much that you get for it, but it'd still be nice to just do it. Lieutenant Mira, 203rd Cadian Regiment. Captain Titus of the Ultramarines. You are in command. I'm all that's left, my lord. Unless my commanders rise from the grave. So far, they seem content to stay put. Lieutenant, the scouts have uh, returned to fall. In the grave? How many? Two. Or off planet. I sent out ten. That damn gun. We don't have the numbers to make an assault. And as you might have seen, it's shooting down all our support vessels. And that is why we are here. Leave the gun to us. Come with me then. I should warn you, my lords. We've got a slight orc problem down here. <laughs> ah, only slight. Genetic scan complete. Adeptus Astarte. Access authorized. Oh, rage meter. Good to have. What do you know of the Titans on this planet? This Only there are troops who sent to guard the Titan Invictus at Manufactorum Ajax. But that was two weeks ago, and we've lost contact with them. We need to reach that Titan. Your fastest route is across the rail bridge behind the gun complex. It leads directly to the western gates of the Manufactorum. Get to the front line. Oh, I'm sorry, that is a five word. Objective. I apologize. Get me that field manual. I'm stuck on bloody forge world and not a single tech priest in sight. That's because all the tech priests are dead. Sorry. They also didn't want to animate the tech priests because they're kind of ridiculous. Oh, 
point in leaving the ammo behind because we'll just keep picking it back up anyway. We won't be able to go back to this. took it almost as soon as we got here, nearly two weeks ago. Our unit was the only one to make landfall before they gained control. Now none of our ships can get past the gun. Oh, that's okay. We'll figure it out. It's the sniper rifle. Or, rather, it's not really a, a sniper rifle, more like a single shot super caliber. That's where the orcs breach the gun battery. Cannon. We haven't been able to make it with inside the, the wall. scope. There just aren't enough of us. You have survived this long on your own, Lieutenant. You have done well. But you are no longer alone. We will retake the gun. You will get your reinforcements. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. Satisfying. Space Marines to kill. Work quotas have been reduced by orcs on the high ground. I shot you again, but now. Oh, shit. That was my bad. When did you get a hop out? When did I miss? Like, I just scooped my hand over so far that I just freaking missed. This is so much fun. A 
lot of fun. More fungus. So yes, um, for all of you out there, orcs are not people; they're fungus. So this is perfectly acceptable by YouTube and Twitch standards. This is not M rating at all. We're just trimming some fungus. That's all we're doing: trimming fungus. It just happens to have red spores. Captain. Assault support pods were dropped in this area. Yay, that means jetpacks.
not bad. Put my chin salt into your chest. Kill some orcs. And no room for that jump pack, Captain. I still want to keep it. Delivered the orcs right into the gun fortress. Into the breach. Those guardsmen cannot survive that long. We find a way to destroy the gun. Oh, yeah. Vengeance. A vengeance launcher. That sounds promising. Firing liquefied vengeance.
Oh, I get you being a shooter. Captain, Melter charges. Put those in the right place, and this whole fortress will come down. We could put the charge on one of the gun shells. Leandros, you do the chapter proud. Oh, yeah. Don't blow up a whole facility. Oversized fungus. Stuff have to glitch where you sometimes just fall randomly if you went to the edge. No, they just prevent you from going to the edge. Oh, no. If it works, don't break it. If it works, don't fix it. Or who let you think that I would give you a chance to kill me?
Did I go through his head and he's still alive? across the way. to get the shell into that loader. Oh, there. Yeah. I will place the charge on that shell. the shell into place. Just imagine how many or how much freaking strength this guy has to have in order to lift this fucking shell. Push it in place. This fucking biggest house. Good luck the orcs will feed it right into the gun's chamber. We cannot rely on luck for this, Sir Dullis. We follow the shell up and make sure it reaches its destination. Aye. Now back to the lift. Destroy the gun battery. useful. Keep clear. This is not a drill. Yes, it is. I drill you in the face. Like an apothecary. Save and then 
We'll call it an end for now. Thank you very much for joining me on the stream. I hope you guys have a great, great night.